Hey guys, it's Michael Crawford here and welcome back. I have bought a brand new camera, really exciting, um, A7R3 and um, it's July 2022 and of course I checked the firmware version, version 1. So I thought, hey, the latest firmware version is version 3.1 when I looked online. I'm going to update it. Um, plugged my computer in, followed all the instructions, downloaded the updater. The computer would not find the camera. Uh, I was having all sorts of trouble. I was trying different cables, trying different methods, lenses, everything. I was trying everything. Um, could not work this one out. Um, spent probably a good couple of hours and a lot of um, almost, um, almost a little bit panic. Um, thinking that I'd got a dud camera. Anyway, I eventually worked out what it is. Uh, this year, in 2022, Sony have changed the A7R 3 They've actually updated it, and they've given it a better rear LCD screen. It's now 2.4 million dots instead of 1.4 million. So that's a great thing if you bought one this year. And they've given it the name, the A7R a. Um, now when you go to update your camera if you've got one, um, make sure you work out which one you have. If you've bought it before now, um, you've probably got the old A7R3. If you've bought this year, um, probably around June um, 2022, um, there's going to be the new model, the A7R3A. Now that's not going to be so much of a problem. Um, just beware when you go to the Sony website that you're looking at the right camera and then you go to the right support page to get the right firmware for your camera and make sure if you've got the A7R3A that you're using the A7R3A updater, not the A7R3 like I was and vice versa. Um, yeah, so save yourself a headache and so that's all for now and I'll catch you guys later. Thanks again. See ya.